mean, you gotta get used to it. And you got Tater on the hero, like you said earlier. Yes. And he does pick the best one. As you, you like that one? Yep. What is that? Um, is that two? What's his name? Wh uh, which hero is that? Because there's eleven. There's um, is it Edric? Yeah, a man's Edric. And then we got two, and then we got one other hero. I don't quite remember all the names. Nah, somebody, somebody in the chat can do the research. Yeah, I mean, anyway. we don't need the more here. Because yeah. because if I say the wrong answer, just say hero. hero. They're all hero. Yeah. <laughs> see, but see, if I say the wrong answer, I'm gonna get tons of flack for it. And I'm that's why you don't take the risk. <laughs> that's why. That's, the worst that's why you don't kamikaze yourself on commentary. Mm -hmm. So <laughs> hopefully Tater will be able to pull off some gang stuff coming in here right now. Ganon's the perfect character to do it. Pull out the down B in neutral. No, I'm just kidding. You know what I don't see a lot of heroes do is charge the neutral B. Like, neutral why not? It's so good. It's ridiculous. Oh good. yes. It's one of the best, but also hero. One thing I don't think people have realized just yet. I think maybe people some for, for sure have. His grab range is horrendous. Oh yes. It's I mean, like, a lot of characters have that issue and. You just, you just gotta get in there with the grab. You gotta like almost be running into their shield when you grab. Did you, you just see Tater hover over the Kamikaze for a few seconds? And then I think maybe like, he was just memeing. Maybe he was just memeing. Am I, I gonna do it? He's just hovering over. For I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it and still win. And those buffs that Hero get, especially with Boom and uh, and Accelerate. Right, those are good in neutral. See, he just avoids it, and now Tater's out of MP. If he throws him off stage, he's gonna throw him off stage. Yeah, he has only one chance to recover. He cannot be. He's waiting. See, he's waiting for his for his uh, MP to regen. That was very smart by Tater. Yeah, it was really good by Tater able to get him off without that stage. So keep Tater really close up with the down tilt. Nicely back. spaced. Yeah. Nicely spaced down tilt. Okay, he's going off stage. He's just falling. Styling down. with the side B. Gonna go for those ledge cancels. Yeah, see, just, he retreats the ledge. He knows the range of, of what Hero can do. And also, there's tons of edge lag on Hero's smash attack. There's ridiculous right. a lot. His arrows are pretty good. They space quite a lot. And that bear is actually pretty good. His up tilt. Yeah, his up tilt is probably his best normal, in my opinion. It's very good at juggling. And Crackle actually oh, catches see, out. See, there was no reason to approach there. He had the he had the lead. I know. But That's it's, the thing. It's you the have end. to respect Hero's RNG. He really do. So he gets the grapple in. But he's got the nice combo. Yeah, he got the side special, which is really good. No air dodge punish on that one, and that's the grab range perfectly shown off. And Hero's back here. <laughs> Hero's back here takes like three years to come out, but my god, doesn't hurt. Right, it's frame 18, I counted it. It's frame, frame 18. Frame 18. Ridiculous. That's almost reactable. Oh my goodness, but just like that, he's able to get, to get it once more, but 126%. Even they're doing a really good job Ooh, actually going for the land. But it's the fair once more. Ganon has been like a lot of big talk, especially for when uh, Nairo pulled him out and gets high and uh, hit that reverse sweep. But people then slowly start to realize, oh, he's a heavy character. He's still kind of exploitable, but his aerials do demand so much respect. Uh, I think a lot of people underestimate the power of this forward air. Yeah, you know. his four air. It swings back. It doesn't hit as hard as me. It's sure as hell it's not as flashy. No. And <gasps> Missed the tech. I, I don't think he was a, any of Ganon's move, of course, could not jab block. But, uh, Actually, uh... Oh, oh up air. God. Back hit of up air. He got the crit because he had psych up. Oh um, he's, he's trolling. Tater. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. Let this man go. He's smiling <laughs> on camera. He knows exactly what he's doing. Does you know what I want to see? You know what I want to see on Heat Smash? What? Is somebody get a shield break? And then run away and kamikaze in the corner as the and, most and disrespectful, the most disrespectful shield break of all uh, time. It's like Shulk shield break when he jumps off with the Monado arts and then comes back down with the side special right off. <laughs> oh exactly. God. It's so good. Was able to flip him out with that new special. I See, like again, uh, again, uh, Mevenator was not respecting Hero's powerful moves. If you just because so, uh, neutral B is probably the, the only thing you don't have to, uh, to re the only thing you don't have to respect with shield. That's not uh -oh. safe on shield, is psych up, as you saw when he broke his shield. Yeah, and he's able to get away from that one. Moving on forward, and he's going to Well, go Tater's ahead. one good RNG away from taking this game. So he's got he's psych using up. the stab. The, the stab boosts are probably the best thing to use in neutral. But the weak spot of up air force him to that situation, and nice cuts catch. him off. I thought he was going to go for the down air, but the nair was a much better option. Oh, did I get called? No, sorry about that. Well, right. uh, I got to head out. Uh, Tempo is probably going to be taking over the, for this second right. game. Appreciate so thank it. You Thank you so much for joining me. Good luck. All right, I shall be taking over for a T3 dome from this moment forward because I got to commentate my homeboy, my Kohai brethren, Hero Match. Hero oh Match? My, yeah. Yeah, Tater's been pulling it out. Um, they're probably going to go on the, the altar. So Tater pulling out of the RNG. Probably saw that. Did you see that shield break they have? Oh, yeah, I saw that shield yeah, break. Yeah, it's, it's a yeah. feels bad. And also, 
Um, it just provides a lot of pressure, but Tater, remember, this is only a best of three other, best of three other game. Yeah. That hero gameplay seemed to be in favor, but actually moving on to the Bowser, interesting. Oh, ba Bowser is like when he like kind of wants to play the clown music in his head, because all he does is like, he's going to try to grab you. He's going to try to command grab you and then just like do there. as much shenanigans as possible. That's, that's Tater's goal? Yeah, Tater's goal is just like, oh, you're shielding, haha, -ha, that's a free command, uh, command grab for me. No. Yeah, but he's going to go ahead and eat already. So much damage already and using that flame breath. Going to get interrupted by the wizard kick, actually. But the up behind his shield, remember, we talked about it's the saving grace of Bowser. All right. Oh. Ooh, that was a strong punish on the normal getup. Mm -hmm. So great job of here, not immediately going to legend. You're talking about those grabs. Here comes the first command grab. And again, he he really loves all of his special moves. Like, he'll use them all as much as possible. And I like that going in low and managing to come back up. But unfortunately, Meepinator going a little bit too high with that back air. And yet again, that down air is a little bit on space. Going to miss him out. And that down air trying to get something out. But a perfectly spaced fair does force him in a really bad situation. Great job by Tater using that down special. But, oh my god, the command grab missing. And it's got a lot of head lag. And there we go, clean air, we'll clean out that stock. But yet again, up B out of shield, really good against pretty much everything in the game. So Tater is going to go ahead and be able to struggle right now. Goes to the back air, but does an auto cancel. And here comes the chain, 74% already. Meepinator destroying the stock with the fair as well, forcing him off stage with Nair. Does get snuffed out, but unable to recover. Yep. And what? <laughs> they, they, they're they just both unable to recover because, my lord, like, what is going on? Yep, yeah, so that's really unfortunate. Tater actually cracking his neck right now. He's trying to go in serious mode with that. Look at that. Side special coming into play. Dash attack. Tater is in huge trouble right now because, you know, Bowser has great comeback potential, but that Wizard's foot is actually able to call it right through that neutral special, and he's going for the intense read. The tech does come into play. He actually shifts out his recovery a little more, but eats the back air to the face. Oh, my God. And you know what? It's unfortunate for Tatinator, but you know it's just one of those days where he doesn't feel like pulling out like the the the, the try hard pants, mm -hmm. you know. Is it best out of five? No, it's best. Out, it's best out of three. That's the set's over. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yep. No, I, I saw Tater getting up a little bit and unrolling the controller, but right. My goodness, it was just a. Uh, it was a hard. It was a hard match. Like he yeah. was able to get those picks off. That hero pick almost worked. But it seemed that Meepinator had a great understanding of hero and also hero's frame data isn't the best. Oh my god, Hero's frame data, like, you know what? His fair and his nair are alright. His bear, ja his bear takes 18 frames to come out. Yeah, his bear takes like 18 frames, 18 years. 18, yeah, yeah, that, 18. that kid is a full-grown adult. You don't have